18 mod working on a project at the moment uh, I've got my mate's rifle he's got a Sarko A7 7mm seven remake um, so it's going to do some loads for it and test it ballistically and work it out for him it's the same rifle as mine so it should be fairly easy I thought I'd bring it along for the journey you might pick up a tip or two there's Owen's rifle there uh, Sarko A7 it's got a scope on it loophole VX6 and he's also got a Harris bipod on it So I've just tested the speed first. Some of you might think I'm doing that backwards, but I'm a believer of copper fouling. So I wanted to put some fouling through the barrel first. Just gonna put a couple of targets up now. Um, hopefully get some good grouping. And that'll save me tweaking with the recipe. See how we get on. We've got Owen's uh, rifle to group. We've got um, three, two shots in the one hole and one down here. Um, so I've just dropped it down one click to zero at 100 meters. So it's pretty happy with that. Oh, we made it up here. We've got our gong set up. Uh, you probably won't be able to see. There's one over there, another one down there, another one further up. The furthest one I think is about a K. So Owen's all excited for validating his uh, drop chart. I'm quite keen to see his uh, ballistic app. Um, weather's not looking the flashes, so we're just going to try and get out there, get it done before the rain kicks in. Looks like it's not too far away, but we'll get into it. I'm just here trying to figure out Owen's uh, drop chart. So you punch in the yards up here, and then you push uh, calculate, and it comes up with your calculation. Yeah, I don't know about your drop chart, Owen. When you ready, Cus? Is it a headache? Yeah. So that's the validation done on uh, Owen's new scope, his uh, VX3. It was slightly different to the VX6, so luckily we went to check it and make sure. Uh, so now we're just going to adjust the uh, speed to make it uh, match up with his uh, ballistic charge. Just fucking... So that's the MOA, 13.69, so to change the speed. Two, two, seven, Changing the speed changes the MOA, which is one click out of that. And if we do the far distance, was uh, 765 yards, 18 point. That's um, one click out as well. So it's pretty much as close as we're going to get it. I think. So that's Owen pretty much sorted. Just to recap on what we did. We changed his projectile to the 175 ELDX, we tested the speed, we got it to group, we went to shoot some gongs to validate his drop chart, and we discovered that his uh, zero stop on his VX6 was no good for shooting long distance, so we ended up changing the scope to the VX3. We went out to shoot some gongs again, validated his drop chart, worked on his shooting process, and tweaked his ballistic, and now he's ready to go. So all he needs to do now is shoot some animals and work on his process. We were fortunate enough to see a couple of stags up in Turang when we were up there. Here's some footage of them. Wait, 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 wait the ones on the left. Oh, we just had World War Three on the back of the farm, right next to the native. We were going through to the spot, then uh, spotted a couple of deer. The next minute, it was, um, I don't know, what counted, eight or nine deer, a couple of stags, spikers, a few hinds. <laughs> it was just a limbo. Fucking heaps of stags just in I'm just setting up the camera. That's a nice one. 
Hold on, hold on. Okay, pull one over to the right of the road. Straight on Hold, hold, these two sticks. These two sticks. Okay, take it then. Being late in the season, I was surprised to hear a stag roaring. I wanted to test my stalking abilities and hear some footage of that. Take over. 